Hey, what's up YouTube and welcome back to another TPX Reviews. Today's review is the continuation of the Max series. This time we got ourselves super dry. Solaris I am still working on. I don't know if I'm going to find that one as quickly as I want to. I'm trying to figure out how to upload these, whether I should just, you know, put out... You're obviously, you already saw uh, Eclipse uh, first and then super dry now, but it's, uh, it's confusing because Solaris will just kind of sit there just waiting to be reviewed because it's not available just yet that I can find. So, uh, anyways, Super Dry has already been released as Extra Strength. Uh, really, this is just a re-review of Super Dry, but I'm hoping they did something a little different to it and changed it up and made it a more unique flavor or just changed it in general. So, without further ado, let's check out this really beautiful green can. It's really, Super Dry has been with us for a long time. Rest in peace, anti, anti gravity. Super Dry and anti gravity was the, after they killed Killer B off, this and anti gravity was the king of the market, and anti gravity was the best. It was like an orange creamsicle extra strength. It was basically. After drinking Max Eclipse, you basically get an idea that it was maybe supposed to be a dub edition the way that, you know, like, the, nowadays this is the new dub edition. So, uh, obviously this readout's the same. So I'll let you guys read it if you haven't. I'm not going to read it for you. I'm not. <laughs> um, so, unfortunately for anti-gravity... It will be missed um, very, very dearly. It was good. It was like an orange version of Dub Edition. Like, all these tastes like Dub Editions to me now in my head because they're, you know, they all, now that I've, my eyes have been open, it, they're really carbonated and they taste like, well, or the mega ones, you know, like, even though, like, they say they added nitrous oxide or whatever to them, to me, anything that comes in one of those crazy twist top cans they're air pressured so when you open them they pop there's the 888 yeah that's the 01188N so I don't know but that's it's gotta be a different number right I actually saw the can with me um that was 018 0118 this was 0188 okay so different batch Different, definitely different type of thing. Um, by the way, the Eclipse has a black tab. I didn't show that, but it's just it's got an, it's got an M on it, so it's a it's a black tab with an M. Nothing too uh, special. Uh, codes. These are just filled. Uh, same code for. Actually, the Eclipse was made in February, February uh, February twenty first, two thousand eighteen. This was, yeah, the 19th of April. Um, so anyway, cool. So that's pretty much everything. Uh, let's check out the, do a little bit more, a better shot of this. Uh, 38 grams of the sugar. Um, yeah, I'm just rambling at this point, which I apologize for. But it's... It's, yeah, the, the nitrous has changed. I didn't think they'd ever get rid of anti-gravity. I thought they would just keep it and expand on it when these were, these came out. In fact, I would have thought that Super Dry would go away maximum strength product compared to Monster 16 ounce. I just noticed that. That's kind of funny. So this is basically uh, different little warning right above it. Maximum strength product. So it's it's like warning you that it, aside from this down here, you get a little extra. Uh, these are basically like having two regular monsters, but they're in a smaller dose. This is like espresso, but in soda. So anyways, holy crap. We're four minutes in. We got to crack it open and sniff. Okay, so it smells like it used to. Kind of like Sprite cleaner. Um, if it makes any sense, lemon lime cleaner. It's Sprite, but it's got a clean smell to it. Basically, yeah, it's it's a lemon lime cleany smell. So um, it's a little different this time around, though. It's got a little bit more of like a pine type of smell. It's very clean. Um, 
don't know how to put it, but it's definitely something different about it. So let's that is really cool. Holy crap. Look at that green. That's like neon green. That would be a crime if they made something nitrous oxide. If you guys remember uh, Crash Bandicoot, Crash, Crash Team Racing, and there was nitrous oxide, the alien lizard thing that you had to race as the boss. He was nitrous oxide green. Like, he was light up green. Um, I get a kick out how Nas is in a blue container with an orange thing and it's it's not green but ni that's supposed to be nitrous oxide this is nitrous oxide green from like crash bandicoot this i haven't seen a green like this since heavy metal so that's crazy cool um i think i've dumped i, I poured out the original super dry but the thing is i can't remember what color that was but oh my god that is an awesome color it's neon green that looks like that would light up amazing at a bar or a lot of people will make a chemical joke right now saying yeah that's what monster does to you it's crap it's neon green it turned you into a uh, nuclear experiment so let's take a sip and see what they if they change it anything hmm yeah i'm getting more of like a like a honey um, oh, that's good. Kind of reminds me of Revolt a little bit, Rockstar Revolt. Um, it's got a lot of, like, a lot of citruses going on, um, which is different than the past. Before, it used to kind of taste a little weird. This has got a nice, like, this is a lot, this is an improvement for sure. Um, hmm. Definitely, definitely an improvement. It's this is like Mountain Dew. It's like Mountain Dew Mellow Yellow, kind of like it's like a mutant, like yeah, like Monster Mutant. But it's like it's like they mixed Super Dry's old formula and Monster Mutant, the green one, together. It's a lot more like lifted, uh, like a lifted flavor. It's a lot more like smoother, more of a citrus flavor. A lot more like like on the lines of like if you went from like a Mountain Dew to yeah it, it's it's got some kind of like sour zing at the back of it it's like it's like more lemon lime than mutant like it's like what mutant should have tasted like honestly it's it really packs a punch like it's a really delicious citrus um it's very smooth and a little sour, a little bit, a little bit of tart. Kind of reminds me of like Spree's. Really, really kind of nails the Spree flavor. Like the, the either the yellow or the green ones. Maybe when you have them together, uh, very like sweet tart. But it's very good. It's very, very. I like this actually a little more because of it's a it's happier, refreshing flavor. I can see why Super Dry stayed on the market. But anti-gravity totally should have as well. This was like the orange sprees, you know, like anti-gravity was like orange sprees. Um, and, and Eclipse was kind of like the purple sprees, really. That's really what I'm getting. I, I mean, I'm thinking about it now. If you want to try any of just go buy a regular monster and drop a spree of what flavor you want to try the purple one to make it eclipse the green to make this the orange to make it they're all spree flavored um like the chewy ones i i ha i love chewy sprees and it's like all i it's all i eat like for candy so i know for a fact what i'm talking about um these are very spree ish so yeah very delicious um it's got like a more of a honey flavor this time around a lot more honey like a lot more uh, citrus definitely honey thrown in there for an extra flavor it's very just super good um i really enjoy it this one's really really great i'm definitely giving this one a 10 it does have its weird quirks though you know it does have a weird like car cleaner type of vibe you know it tastes like you're it's like drinking something you shouldn't be drinking it's like not not that it's not healthy but like if chemical tasted like how they smell without you dying basically so 
that's basically it. Um, I'm just gonna wrap it there because that's that's it. That's that's exactly what it is. It's delicious. Uh, definitely check it out um, if you have the chance to. Um, that's a ten, uh, and I guess we'll find out what Solaris is all about next. So, I guess stay tuned and uh, thanks for watching. Uh, but yeah, heavy metal green. spree flavored crazy carbonated concoction um there's probably more to the flavor i just i can't think of it it's just really citrusy like a mellow yellow or mountain dew but way stronger way way stronger than a soda it's got a more of a sour zing at the back it really gets you um like an artificial generic brand of mountain dew it's very powerful um so yeah hope you, hope you guys enjoyed uh i'll see you guys very soon I guess I'll upload these two, it's what I found, and then Solaris later down the road, so thanks for watching dudes, and uh, peace out.